Welcome to the What's Inside the Box and Tools Required segment for the Master Platform. In this video instruction guide, you will see what is included in the box, how it is used during the setup of the product, and what tools you will need to finish the assembly. Begin by removing the components from the box. Carefully place them on a flat surface. Now, before you get started with the assembly, be sure to verify that all the parts are present. In the box, you should have one tray assembly, two wheels, part one, one lift tube assembly, part two, one lift handle, part three, one center brace, part four, two hitch tubes, part five, one lift handle catch, part six, two one half by four inch hex bolts, part seven, two five sixteenths by two and one half inch hex bolts, part eight, four five sixteenths by three quarter inch hex bolts, part nine, four five sixteenths by one and one half inch hex bolts, part ten, three five sixteenths by one inch hex bolts, part eleven, two half inch nylock jam nuts, part twelve, two one half inch jam nuts, part thirteen, 13 5 16 inch nylock nuts, part 14, 2 3 8 by 3 quarter inch clevis pins, part 15, 2.08 by 1.58 inch hair cotter pins, part 16, 1 cotter pin, part 17, 1 universal hitch, part 18, and 2 lower lift tubes, part 19. You will also need the following tools which are not included. Two three-quarter inch wrenches and two half inch wrenches. In addition, one of these three tools or a combination of the tools may also be utilized. A crescent wrench, an open wrench, and a socket set. Now unpack the box to make sure you have all the parts and the hardware required. Make sure that there are no missing parts before you begin assembly. Always read the rules for safe operations and the instructions carefully prior to using this equipment. For additional or missing parts, please contact the manufacturer directly. Now, in the next segment, we will begin assembly.